Okay, uh, a couple days ago I posted a video on how to enable auto-completion in the Python console. So let's go ahead and have a look at that. Start up Python. I'm running Python 2.71 here. And we're going to import two modules. So import read line, comma, and also import rl completer. Oops. Now that both of those are imported, now we just need to set up what key we want to autocomplete with. So we'll use the read line uh, function here, or module here. And we're going to say uh, parse underscore and bind inside here, inside some parentheses and single quotes, we said tab colon complete. Now if I type in im and hit tab, it auto-completes. If I create a variable, my var equals hello, hello. Now I can type in print, I can type pri and hit tab, and then I can hit my and tab and hit see if it's auto-completing for us. But a lot of people are asking how to set other keys to become, uh, instead of tab, in case they want to still use their tab um, button like they normally would. Well, I did a little Googling, and it's uh, there's a number of different ways to do it, and I'll just show you one or two little options here. Um, what we could do is, we can say, read line, whoops, read line, parse, and, bind. And this time, instead of saying tab, there are other things we can put in there as such as um, backslash capital C, which would be control, and then you can give it dash another key. So in this case, I'll go control T. It will say colon, and what do we want it to do when we press that? Complete. I could type today. Okay. Now if I type IM, as an import, I can hit Control T and it will autocomplete. Now, since I already set tab, tab still works, so I can hit tab and it will autocomplete. So, obviously, clear that out um, by not running that line. And if you put it in your RC files, re replace it with the new one. The next time you start Python, it will autocomplete that way. Um, we can also do something like uh, backslash C dash for control, and we can say, oops. I, I just can't hit any of the right keys today. Okay, dash, and we can just type out space. Now if I type in IM, I can hit control space bar and it auto-completes. Um, something you probably don't want to do though is not have control there, because if I hit, just put space complete. Now if I type in IM, I can hit space bar and it completes, but my space bar doesn't work anymore. I can't put any spaces in there. So be sure that you use uh, control C before keys that you may want to use. Um, as I said, I Googled this. Supposedly backslash M is for um, a meta key, which is usually your Windows key, because some people ask about that. Uh, either I'm doing something wrong or my keyboard's funky because I couldn't get backslash, like if I do uh, instead of backslash C, I can't do backslash M space, because if I do that, oh. It did work. Why did I think that didn't work when I tried it earlier? Okay, backslash M would be your Windows key. Um, and there were also keys for like a function key, if you have a function key on your keyboard. Um, and uh, I'll put a link in the description to a uh, website that has a lot of information on this. Um, it goes way more in depth than we've gone over in these videos. Also check out my previous video on this to see how to add this to your Python RC file and your bash RC file so that you don't have to add these two lines every time you come into the console. Basically, it would just automatically import that stuff and run that command. So I thank you for watching. Please visit filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. There should be a link in the description. And I hope that you have a great day.